inside the pot that never dies, the pot still believes in life after a jump. Sound off from stories now. Right, so here we go again, one more time, same photos, this time with a few comments from me, Chelsea London, a few days ago. Here's a lovely antique bookshop, tiny little shop, but this man has no time for old books. He's far too busy typing mobile numbers into his phone. Chelsea has lots of galleries. This one is a peculiar one because it seems to have no exhibits. It is empty, but that doesn't really matter because this woman has no time for galleries anyway. This brasserie boasts that it's open every hour of every day throughout the year, but even so, this man walks by. No time. Neither does this woman have time for another gallery, the Little Black Gallery, although this one does its utmost to attract the attention of passers-by. I wonder first time around, did you not only notice the main exhibit, but also the smaller one in the top right corner? Yes, it is herself, Her Majesty, Queen Elizabeth, and I think she has to close her eyes because she just can't look at the lady on the left. This is St Andrew's Church in Chelsea and they have an important message for us. They are under new management. Quite reassuringly it's the same boss. But this man has no time and you know the rest. Now this photo is actually the only one that I staged because I was standing there forever waiting for a person to pass by so I could have the same effect of a person walking quickly past the landmark I was photographing and no one came. And suddenly as I was waiting there someone comes up to me and I think I know this man and it was a colleague from St Melitus College. So he very kindly agreed to be my willing victim and then afterwards he showed me around his church where he works which is just a few minutes down the road. Here it is, St John's Church, part of a big housing estate. And if you don't believe me that this church is literally a few minutes from the other one in posh Chelsea, here we go. Housing estate with St John's Church, then you turn 180 degree, cross King's Road, and suddenly you are back in good old Chelsea. And this blue restaurant you can see there on the left is apparently quite famous, La Familia, one of its claims to fame is that recently Jennifer Aniston booked the whole place out for a birthday party. The housing estate is in a part of London called World's End. Bit of an unfortunate name. And here is the World's End Distilleries. Unfortunately, this young man has no time for World's End Distilleries. So, we now know where World's End is. But we still don't know when World's End is. Is it in... 13 minutes, 13 hours, weeks, months, years, decades, centuries, only God knows. All we know is, time is running. Mm -hmm.